Hey, how's it going guys? Mr. Boss for the win here, and in today's Grand Theft Auto 5 online video, I'm going to be showing you guys some new cars that Rockstar has actually added to Grand Theft Auto Online for the first time. These are going to be vehicles that up until now were only available in single player and not available to purchase in GTA Online. So if you do like this video or find the information helpful, please drop a like on the video guys, I would really appreciate it. Other than that, let's get started. So these cars are going to be located under the travel and transport lot, and you can see that there's some new cars added, including topless editions of previous cars. Now this Stinger right here is priced at $871,000, so the topless version is actually $4,000 cheaper than its hardtop GT counterpart. You can see that right there. There's some more editions of cars like that. The Coquette is actually $159,000 topless compared to $138,000 non-topless. Same thing with the Voltic. The Voltic is $172,000 topless as compared to $150,000 non-topless, and the Banshee is almost $20,000 more expensive with the topless modification on it so you can see some new vehicles have been added with the uh, ability to take the top off to not have the top off right now I'm actually gonna buy this coquette right here because I have one in my garage so I can give you a comparison of how they look coming straight out of the factory and what they look like when you're in your garage modified because the coquette I have right now does have the roof attachment on it so you can see the car to the left the matte greenish painted one you can see that is my coquette with a hard top roof looks pretty nice one of my favorite sports cars in the game and you can see the fresh one I just got the really tacky uh, orange and red one without a roof right there. So that's what it looks like if you were to just get it straight from the website. Topless cars like that are really cool and now you have the option to purchase them in game. Now Rockstar has also added some more cars that you can buy under uh, Southern San Andreas, superautos.com and legendarymotorsport.net. I've already mentioned a couple of them but I'll go over all of them right now. Uh, the Bravado Banshee Topless, the Inverto Coquette Topless, the Vapid Dominator, the Ocelot F620, the Shyster Fusilade, the Matsubatsu or however you say that, uh, Penumbra, the Ubermox Sentinel X. SX, uh, the Ubermax Sentinel Convertible, the Grati Stinger Topless, and the Coil Voltic Topless. So a lot of those we've covered. Some of them I didn't show because they were under the Super San Andreas Auto. But you can purchase some vehicles that were, uh, at for the time, no longer available in Grand Theft Auto Online unless you found them on the street. So this is really cool. I, I love when Rockstar does this. They did this um, in their last update for the business update. They made a lot of rare cars available or ones that were hard to find available to purchase. So I know a lot of you guys like collecting either cars that might have a certain memento to you or have a special place in your heart or for whatever reason you really like the look of it. So. I'm really glad that Rockstar has decided to do this. They've made a lot of cool cars available, and I thought I would show this to you guys because it wasn't like a highlight feature as part of the business or the high life update. So I thought I would bring this to you guys. Hopefully, some of you learned a thing or two and maybe even found a cool topless car that you want as well. Other than that, guys, like I said, if you did enjoy the video or found the information helpful, please drop a like on the video, guys. I would really appreciate it. And be sure to check the link in the description to check out all the other high life videos I've done today. I've done like seven. It's been crazy. So other than that, like I said, thanks for watching. Take care. And of course, I'll see you guys in the next video.